into the crowd. So Leeds, Saints with two men down, two first choice men, yes. Wellens and Shenton. Paul James. You've got to look towards uh, Danny Maguire or Rob Barrow to pull something out of the, the hat. Two. They're capable. Go. Oh, and there's another Sinit Scott Moore who's down. And he's just groggily making his way back into the defensive line. Brian McDermott anxiously looking on. Here is Webb! Webb will score for Leeds! He snaked the arm as it's not given yet. Oh, well, did you think there's a double move? There's no double movement, never no. in a million, not in no, no. years. Yeah, but the referee just wants to make sure. Brent Webb, he's pretty confident. Shot will tell you that's a try. The ball carried on, didn't hit the deck in the field of play, and that is wonderful. Leads are back in it. And if ever a man wanted a moment like that, yep. after the Tommy Makinson try at the other end, it's Brent Webb. He's repaid his coach, Brian McDermott, in big time. It's way out to the left hand side, and it's a pressure kick again from Kevin Sinfield. The try scorer. He got a try in the 2007 Grand Final win against St Helens here as well. It was good work. Beautiful dummy. Now remember, that would be the position that Michael Shenton would have been in. In the end, they've had to push Solly Ola out there. Well, they pulled him out of the second row to take up Shenton's position, and the way that Shenton's been tackling in 19. Now then, this is a kick, this is a kick. And that is a kick from Sinfield. Confidence is going through the bodies of this Rhinos outfit. And allow TT, he's a man with an offload, and that's a penalty. Two-pointer, two-pointer, coming up from Sinfield, surely. Yep. That's what I'd do, and you can see it was ripped away. And they've just lost the plot, I'm afraid, of St. Helens. He's furious. Well, he is. And Roy Simmons is furious as well that this penalty was given away. And Brian McDermott is trying to remain cool, calm and collected. I don't know how. I don't know how these coaches are doing it. How does Kevin Sinfield slow everything down in his body now and prepare for this kick? He's just been driving the ball up, tackling all the pressure. He's tapped on the side. He now has to calm himself down, zone all, all this other noise out. He's 70-odd thousand people here and focus solely on this kick. Focus solely on getting that ball over those posts. It's a wonderfully difficult skill, but he is a master at it. Well, the captain of Leeds in their sixth grand final. And Sinfield has kicked the goal. in this fella, there it is, high and high, look at the hang time, oh look at the hang time, they've got it back, not for long, Gaskell, he slid over the sideline by Ben Jones, he was tackled near, but he was off a bounce ball, yeah, so he did not take his back, but he's gone high and low this young fella, it's off a bouncing ball, He's had a good game, I think, Cheers, Phil Bentham. And uh, okay, Lee Gaskell just asking Phil Bentham, and he's just saying, yeah, bouncing ball, it was off a bouncing ball. Time. Now, Eddie, this is where pressure, the stakes get punished. The pressure comes on as the clock is ticking. The clock might end up beating you. And any mistake that you possibly will make cost your team a grand final. That creeps into your head sometimes. You've got to try and push it out. Suddenly leads then. Having got back level, they have up the ante here. Ten and a half minutes to go, 16 all. It's all about controlling defence as well, you've got to make sure that... Oh, here he goes! Here goes Burrow! Oh, brilliant! Brilliant! Ryan Hall! Brilliant try! Engineered by Burrow, scored by Ryan Hall! Outstanding rugby league! Absolutely outstanding! And Rob Burrow, I think he might be going home with a man of the match award tonight. I agree with you, Eddie. It's all about that impact player. The man 
position by Ryan Hall, right in front of all the Rhino supporters. Mr. Superman, big beef, what a dummy, what an upload, and what a T.R.Y. I tell you what, sensational. that try from took some scoring. It created brilliantly, but it took some scoring on this stage. That's just got everything in it. Rob Burrow, that is a... He's had contributions in two magnificent tries. It wasn't just his break, it was his patience to hold on to the ball. That is stu superb. Well... They're celebrating. It was just in front of them where he scored. And now Kevin Sinfield... Well, that's the degree of difficulty that he's got. But how often have we seen the greatest goal kicker in Leeds club's history kick these? And this is a pressure cooker that he's kicking this one in. Missed it. Not over yet. Not over yet. Just over 30 metres away from their own line. Sinfield. Oh, and he got the ball away to Webb somehow. And he's got the fly inside. He's got Zakarnik outside. The chase is on. And Melly to the rescue. Great work. Absolutely superb. They applied the pressure to two kickers. First McGuire and then Kevin Sinfield. And this man, Brent Webb, the fullback, said, Give it to me. Hardacre, how's that for being cool? This could seal it. But they now can apply the pressure once again. No, they've got a blind time. It's good work. It's Ablett. It's Ablett. He's
it's been an outstanding performance this certainly is they were trying to force the ball St. Telen's given credit for that but Zach Hardaker he will remember this for a long long time Gaskell tried something different Hardaker it was a gift in the end he knew that he'd slide over celebration time for the man Brian McDermott and Jimmy Lowe's they've seen success as a player now they achieve success coaches an emotional time and what a wonderful time for Brian McDermott and what a moment for Zach Hardaker as well two tries in the losing championship grand final with Featherston last year the last try in the 2011 Super League grand final Sinfield has the extras that's only important for the margin and it's a big big winning margin in the end Leeds have won it and James Graham consoles the youngsters